about working for yourself. Being the boss, setting your own hours, every day is bring your dog to work day. But you didn't say invoicing. Send customized invoices in a moment with QuickBooks. Know when they've been seen, paid, or are overdue. So you can stay on top of your cash flow and get back to more enjoyable things. QuickBooks, back in you. Available now for up to 50% off your first six months. For terms and conditions, visit quickbooks.co.uk. know how good that feeling is. And if you're a first-time buyer, we'll do everything we can to help make it happen for you. Halifax, giving extra to first-time buyers. At Subway, we think you should take life for all you can. And with the new Subway saver menu starting from 99p, why not? There's crispy golden hash browns, taco beef mini wrap, nachos, chorizo flatbread pizza, and taco beef nachos. The price is starting from 99p. There is no reason not to grab life by the jalapenos. Subway, make it what you want. Prices and participation may vary. See in store for details. Treat the festive Zampini. This week, Schroeder 750 mil, just 89p. Only at Spars, Eurospar, Vivo and Vivo Extra. Offer in November 18th. At Argos, get three for two across the top brand toys, including designer friends, Lego and Paw Patrol. Mix and match with thousands of lines to choose from. And get a Hoover Smart Washing Machine for just £249. With Argos, you're good to go. Conditions apply, selected lines, choose a toy free, offers end 13 to November. It happens when it matters. This is Downtown Radio News. It's 2 o'clock on Sasha Wiley. First this hour, another £1 million is being pumped into Belfast City Centre. The money has been announced by the head of the civil service. It comes as it's revealed footfall in the city has dropped by 60% in the wake of the blaze which destroyed Primark. Only Holland has more. This latest £1.1 million boost brings the total amount of the fire recovery package to £6 million. It's hoped the additional funds will help entice shoppers back into the city centre in the crucial Christmas run-up. The money's come from three different Stormont departments and the initiative includes things like improving open spaces in Belfast with plans for outdoor seating and dining, street art and events. There will also be a festive travel campaign with major discounts on Translink buses and trains as well as extra services including midnight departures. David Sterling also says a longer term strategy is being planned for the next three to five years. And there's more on this on our website. In other news, Brexit negotiations remain deadlocked over measures to prevent a hard border. Officials from both sides were engaged in talks until the early hours of this morning, but failed to produce a breakthrough. Gordon Brown says he thinks there will be a second EU referendum. The former Labour Prime Minister claims there's no reason why Britain couldn't renegotiate with Brussels after another vote. I, for one, have always said that I think there will be a, a second uh, referendum. I believe that in the end, the situation will have been seen to have changed since 2016, and that the people should, in the end, have the final say. Elsewhere, at least 31 people have been killed in California's deadliest ever wildfires. Most of them were killed in the town of Paradise. More than 200 others are still missing, and thousands of homes have been destroyed. Organic farmer Kerry Claffey tried to fight the flames from her roof. And then the wind shifted, and it was like, I knew. I was right at that moment. We're done. We're toast. And I remember yelling, Caesar! And he came up, and we both looked at each other, and we knew we had to evacuate. We didn't even have to evacuate. Anyway, we just stood there and watched everything burn down. And finally, Bobby Burns has earned his first senior Northern Ireland call-up. The Hearts teenager, now on loan with Livingston, joins the squad for Thursday's friendly with the Republic and the Nations League game with Austria. Burns played the full 90 minutes in his side scoreless draw with Celtic yesterday. And a check on the weather, mainly dry and bright today with highs of around 11 degrees. Now that's your latest from downtown Kill FM News, it's 2.02. <laughs> Listen everywhere in Northern Ireland on DAB Digital Radio. Downtown Radio. A very good afternoon to you. Welcome back. Right now it's time to go back 
in time for the next half hour or so. And uh, the first track we're going to play to you on this day in music in 1988, U2 started a six week run at the number one spot in the US album chart with their sixth studio album, Rattle and Hum, which went on to sell over 14 million. 